I hope you guys are ready because it's time for Vlogmas Day 5. everyone I have an itchy armpit I don't even know what to say about that I can't even try to hide it but that happened so that's how I'm starting my video with you guys BT dubs I don't know if you guys have ever noticed this but my clock right there always says that it's just before two o'clock and it's not actually two o'clock it's actually 8.34 in the morning, but I am getting ready for the day. Actually, I already got ready. Um, I didn't do my hair though because I am shooting a hair tutorial today, so I just washed my hair so it's clean, but I haven't styled it yet because I'm going to be doing some different hair looks, and I'm not sure what I'm going to be wearing, so I just put on a comfy top while I make breakfast and stuff. Nugget already had his breakfast though, right? Now he's like, I'm ready for my early morning nap. He was in the bathtub earlier this morning. If you follow me on Snapchat, then you definitely saw that. He just loves being in the bathtub and he's been like that ever since he was a kitten. He would always just hang out in my bathtub and don't know why. He also likes the shower too. He's really strange for a cat because he doesn't mind water and most cats don't like water at all. Speaking of water, I am heating up some for my tea that I'm making today. And since that, let's check on this water. I think it's gonna need a little bit more time. Okay, I think I have enough time to go make my bed. So I am going to go and do that right now. I have candles burning everywhere. I have sweater weather in my room, spiced apple toddy right there, and then I have my leaves candle out in the kitchen. I have to show you guys that candle because I feel like there's something up with the leaves candle, but let me make my bed first because that just needs to happen. Of course, Nuggos has to help out with the bed making. He always does this. Whenever I make my bed, he either gets underneath the covers, but he missed that today because you were a little slow because you were sitting on the chair and you didn't know what I was doing. So today, he has jumped on top and he's like, I am the king of this bed. Yeah, you tell him, Nugget. You tell him. You're just my little Nuggo monster, aren't you? My little blue-eyed monster. I saw somebody on Twitter say that Nugget has changed a lot in color and obviously size since he was a kitten. And that's because Nugget is a ragdoll cat. So he is going to be three years old really soon, actually just a little bit later this month, he'll officially be three. So he is fully matured in color and ragdoll kittens all start off as like this creamy color here and as they get older their true coloring starts to come out all of his extremities are darker including his little ears look at those little ears there are seal ragdolls which actually get really dark and those are like the super super dark brown ones that you see but nugget is the like dusty gray color but sometimes in certain lighting you look like a seal let's be honest in reality he's a manatee a little fluff manatee i'm sure you guys can also tell that he has grown a lot since being a kitten and male ragdolls because ragdoll cats are just naturally big um males are normally between 20 and 30 pounds like 30 pounds is on the really really big size i feel like now that i have nugget I have this distorted view of cats because I'll go over to my friend's houses and they have cats and I'll see them and think, oh my gosh, your cat is so little. And then I realize, oh no, my cat is just a big boy, right? Just a big ball of fluff that likes to lay like this. My tea is steeping now and this is the tea I'm having today. It's the Nutcracker Sweet Black Tea that I got over the weekend. So I'm excited to try this out. Now with a richer vanilla flavor, ho ho. And in case you guys are wondering, I'm feeling a lot better today. Last night was actually just what I needed. I ordered takeout from Eat24 or delivery, I guess I should say. And Eat24 is freaking amazing because you can just order food from your phone and have it delivered. So that is like right up my alley and T-Rex hands are necessary for that. I don't know 
know where the T-Rex hands thing came from, but I just do this all the time and everybody in my life points it out to me. So now I just point it out to myself and it has just become part of what I do. T-Rex hands when I get excited about things or I like something the T-Rex hands come out like this. I ordered chicken tikka masala for Chris and I because that's like comfort food for the two of us and it just made me feel better. He came over, we ate together, and he had to work, but it was just nice having him around and we just had like a chilled out couple of hours. By the way, this is my leaves candle and look how much it has burned. It is like almost gone. Then over here I have my spiced apple toddy candle and I always burn these candles at the same time. I have never burned this candle without the leaves candle also burning and vice versa. And look how much is left of this candle. Pretty sure that means my theory that the leaves candle burns faster than other candles at Bath & Body Works is true. So here's my breakfast today, same cereal as yesterday, and then I have my tea in one of my favorite Christmas mugs because I love what this says. So Christmas isn't just a day, it's a frame of mind. And this is from Miracle on 34th Street, and I think that's so true. I feel like just the holidays in general, it's not just a time of year or a day, it's really about your mindset and surrounding yourself with people that you care about and doing things that make you feel good. Oh, uh, someone is chatty today. It's because he wants his little mouse that I have. I spent the past few hours shooting, so I started cleaning up, but I still have some more to do. My hair is looking a little cray cray because I did three different hairstyles and whenever I do like multiple hairstyles in one sitting, my hair just ends up being crazy. The video I just filmed is going up right before Christmas, so these can be like holiday looks or looks to wear for the new year because I feel like we all kind of get stuck in hair ruts and it's just cool to have you know, different inspiration. I look on the internet and get inspiration all the time for hair. So um, yeah, now this is what my hair is doing. And I changed back into my comfy top, but I still have my red lip on, so that's cool. You know I kept my pajama pants on though while I was filming and my slippers because gotta be comfy, especially since I sit normally on that gold puff. It's just more comfortable to be in pajama pants when I'm lower to the ground like that. But yeah, I should get this all cleaned up so I can get my Vlogmas video for today. I have voiceovers that I need to do. I have to finish the voiceover for this weekend's video, so that can be good to go. I have another voiceover I have to do for another video, and then just random laptop-y stuff. But I did the dishes! So, yeah, my sink was full of dishes this morning, so I'm feeling good that the sink is now empty. I'm gonna go clean this up now, after I scratch my nose. Oh man, my voice is tired from doing the voiceover because I kept having to do it over and over and over again because there's like construction happening. So I would think, oh, I got it. And then somebody would start pounding or using a saw or something. And then I would be like, mm, I don't got it. Let me do that over again. I'm pretty excited about this video going up this weekend. It's a DIY video, I will tell you that. But I do also want to thank you guys because I'm looking on Twitter right now and I am just completely flooded with the most amazing tweets. My It's Okay to Have a Bad Day vlog went up a couple hours ago and it is just so amazing to see all your tweets. You guys are so supportive and just kind. You guys have been sending in photos and just really sweet tweets and all of your little edits and things make me laugh. You guys are like hilarious. Like what <laughs> is this? Oh my God, this is amazing. Jenny Dixon, you little weirdo. I freaking love you. Oh, let's see this one. It's a Nuggo's Christmas love affair. This is gonna be good. Oh man. Someone's all tuckered out though over here in the corner. Oh, look at those stretches. 
Oh, hello, Nuggos, coming out. I just got the best photo of Nugget yawning, which I will make the thumbnail of this video because Nugget yawns are pretty hilarious. Oh, don't mind me. I just have an itchy ear over here. I'm just gonna scratch that. Nugget is British today. Oh, see, look at those yawns. So you know what Nugget looks like when he yawns. This is what I look like when I yawn. Ooh, I actually yawned from that. <laughs> I feel like if you just hold your mouth open long enough, you eventually just yawn. Right now I'm prepping for a video that I'm gonna be shooting on Saturday. So I just have some outfits laid out here. I've tried on so many different combinations and these are my favorite. So it's gonna be a New Year's video and these are some of the outfits. I figured I'd give you a little sneaky peek, but how pretty is this dress? I'm also gonna be wearing this dress to a friend's birthday party because it's Gatsby themed and I think that that is super pretty. It's dinner time and it is leftovers tonight. Um, what are we gonna call this, Chris? Lusty Leftovers. Lusty Leftovers. Wow. <laughs> okay. Named by Kurnov. Here is the Lusty Leftovers spread. We have stuff from last night. The Chicken Tikka Masala. This one's mine because I like it spicy. This one is Chris's because he doesn't. A little bit of butter lettuce. I think we're going to finish this up tonight. And then pasta from the other day. And then chicken. So... Kind of an interesting combination of food, but I'm down for it. I'm hungry and I'll eat it. All right, well, I was gonna end my vlog, but then this happened over here. Can you guess who's underneath that? Nugget loves being under blankets. I told you when I make my bed, he does stuff like this. And now he found the couch blankie to play with. Now it is giveaway time. So if you would like to enter today's giveaway, all you have to do is make sure that you're following me on Twitter at Hey Ingrid Nilsson. Use screenshots from this video to create an edit that you post on Twitter using the hashtag Vlogmas. And that is it. I will be picking my favorite. And the prizes for today are pretty cool. The first prize is this skincare set. And you get the Origins Clear Improvement Mask, a Glam Glow Mask, and then my favorite Bosha Mask. And then also this Cucumber Gel Mask down here. Prize number two is this super sparkly cute little case filled with two Deborah Lippman nail polishes. Inside is Glitter and Be Gay, which is one of my favorites. It's an amazing glitter, and it's actually, I think, this glitter that's on the outside. That's what the nail polish looks like. It's incredible. If you want a chance to win those two things, make sure you enter the giveaway, and that is all for today, folks. I'll see you manana. Peace out.